Hey everybody, recently this spirit store opened up close to us and we decided to check it out. There's other spirit stores that have been open, but since this one was the closest to us, we decided to take a quick look around and show you guys what they have. We start off in the t-shirt section and they had a lot of cool t-shirts. I actually own one, it's from The Crow. Here's a better look at it. They had a lot of cool shirts that I wanted, like that Chucky one, and the Crow one, that's the one that I have. The Creepshow one, and this Pennywise right here was really cool. But a lot of these shirts are around $21 or $22 each, but uh, I really like that uh, Michael Myers one, but unfortunately they didn't have any in stock. I definitely want to go back and get some more shirts. There's a Scream one right there, you can see that actually glows in the dark, I thought that was pretty cool. And here we have a animatronic for Sam from Trick or Treat. And I think he was going for $180. Yeah, $180, which isn't too bad. It looks pretty good. And they also had a lot of other merchandise from uh, Trick or Treat. And here's Sam in action. Next we have some Beetlejuice stuff and it wasn't fully stocked yet but they had some costumes and they had this really cool light up sign. I definitely want that. I think it was going for like $50 or something. And we have these masks that um, even though the hair looks a little weird, they were pretty cool. One of them was like $30 and that one was um, you just slide it over your, your face and the other one was like $70 you actually pull it over your head. and. Um, Here's actually the, the sign that lights up. I think this is so cool. And next we have some Beetlejuice uh, coffee mugs and cups and tumblers. Um, I think the best one for me was that one with the tombstone and the sandworm handle. I think that one was pretty cool. But honestly, I'd be happy with anyone. We found this little plastic cup for Beetlejuice and I think it was $2.99, so a really great price. Next we saw these cool doormats and I think they're awesome, I love the design. And we also have some sandworm candle holders and these awesome sandworm snow globes. Sandworms, you hate them right? And then we saw some cool stickers and some Beetlejuice socks, can't go wrong with those. And right next to the Beetlejuice stuff, we had other mugs from like Freddy Krueger and Pennywise. And that Freddy Krueger mug is really detailed. But they had some from Jason and uh, Michael Myers. And over here we had some uh, Pennywise uh, little decorations and Freddy book. And that book on top was actually from It Chapter 2. And that's a really cool Michael Myers mug. They also had some more signs for It and Hocus Pocus and Krampus trick-or-treat and nightmare before Christmas next we saw these uh, Pennywise statues and there was a Sam one for trick-or-treat and they glow it actually looks like this when they glow next we found this uh, Pennywise area with costumes and they had two masks I think the top one was from Ruby's and this bottom one was from trick-or-treat studios had lots of socks and they even had the costume from the 1991. We found a little Chucky section where they had costumes. Next we found this uh, Ghostbusters little area where they had costumes and the Stay Puft Man costume and the jumpsuits. They even had the little PKE meter and some cool Slimer socks, Stay Puft socks. Next we found this little Freddy vs. Jason section and they had a lot of stuff from both. They had a lot of like Freddy sweaters and Jason masks and costumes. They even had this cool uh, Welcome to Camp Crystal Lake sign that I really want. Um, they had a jersey and they had this really cool camp counselor outfit that we thought was pretty cool. We don't know if it's brand new or if it's old so if you guys know let me know.
Next we see the special effects makeup aisle and a lot of the stuff I do remember in previous years, but um, I'm not sure if they have anything new. They had some Hocus Pocus stuff and they had some stuff from the Haunted Mansion. A lot of it's still, um, you know, not in stock and they're bringing it out, but hopefully it, everything will be stocked soon. Next we saw their wall of masks and like I said before, not they don't have everything in stock yet, but the things that stood out to me were the Jigsaw mask and the Michael Myers mask from 2018. I think it's from Trick or Treat Studios and seeing it in person looks really cool. They didn't have that new one from Halloween Kills yet, but um, this one looks so awesome. It's uh, $70 I think. They had a little Michael Myers end cap. They had a few shirts there and some masks. I think from Halloween and Halloween 2 and uh, the new mask. They had a very small selection of killer clowns from outer space. They had a few costumes left and one or two masks and I think a hat. They had this really cool uh, clown animatronic and we're going to set it off right now. And that was pretty much it. The spirit store was very small and it had just opened so they didn't have everything in stock but it was still fun to take a quick sneak peek and see what they have. I hope you enjoyed this video and I thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.